In this video, I will demonstrate another method to do a two-dimensional lookup. Earlier, we had used the VLOOKUP and MATCH functions. Now, we will use INDEX and MATCH functions. Before starting, let me explain the data that I have. I have the sales revenue for a list of items for three months. And I want to look up the value of a specified item for a specified month in the cell. To do this, we'll use the index and match functions. Let's first understand the parameters of the index functions. So index function has three parameters. So the first parameter is array. Array is nothing but the area where we want to search the data. The second is row number. Row number is the is that number in the row which you want from where you want to pick up the data. And column number is the column from where you want to pick up the data. So we have the area from where we want to search the data but we need to calculate the row number and the column number. We'll calculate these using the match functions. So match function has three parameters again. The first one is the lookup value. That is the value that you want to search. The second one is the lookup array. That is the area where you want to search the value. And the third one is the type of match. That is an approximate, uh, exact, or greater than or lesser than match. So first I'm trying to get the row number here. So my lookup value is this. My lookup array is here. And the match type, I want the exact match. So I type in zero, press enter. So glass is at the seventh position here. Suppose I change it to soap, it changes to eight. Now, using the second match function, we'll find out the column number. So I want to look up the month. My lookup area is this and I want the exact match. So Jan in this range is in the second column. Suppose I change this to Feb, it will return the third column. We change it to March, it will return the fourth column. Now we we'll factor these two results into the index function and get the desired result. So equals index. So my first parameter is nothing but the area that I want to search the data in. The second one is the row number which I've calculated using the match function. And the third one is the column number which again I've calculated using the match function. So I'm getting the result as 40. So the sales of glass for the month of January is 40. Now let's combine all these into one function equals index so my array or the area where we want to search this data is this row number I'll calculate using the match function. So I'm searching for this value in this range and I want to exact match. That gives me my row number, comma. So I want my column number which again I'll use the match function to get it. I'm searching column number which which is for the month and my lookup value is this and the lookup area is this and I want the exact match. press enter. So now I'm getting the Jan sales data for glass as 40. Suppose I change this to Feb. So I get 25. Now let's 
let's try and change the item description say I change this to pencil I get 85 let's say I change this to crayons I get 20 